I'm glad to introduce you Professor Jakob Dulcic from Croatia. Is a, uh, Jakob is a member of our academic board since the beginning of this PhD program. And he's the head of the Laboratory of Ichthyology and Coastal Fisheries at the Institute of Oceanography and Fisheries in Croatia. And he is also, he's a zoologist and, uh, of course, a marine biologist and ecologist, and uh, is specialized in the Mediterranean problem, and especially in uh, his performing research in the Adriatic and along the Croatian coast. And he's working on changing in uh, fishing and marine biology diversity during the last uh, years. So <clears throat> I'm glad to have with us uh, Jakob and uh, invite him to uh, start this lesson. Uh, thank you very much to everyone. And to Mariana for the technical assistance, which is not uh, uh, banal. <clears throat> Yakov, it's yeah. your stage. Okay, you for sure see my presentation on the board. Yeah? Stefano? My microphone. Yes, we can yes, see. Yes, it. yes, we see the presentation. Everything is okay. working. Okay. Thank you for your introduction and few words about me. Uh, I am working in the Institute of Oceanography and Fisheries in Split Spalato. And uh, even though Stefano said that I am a marine biologist, yes, I mean, I am marine biologist, but primar primarily I'm, I'm ichthyologist. So my occupation are mostly fishes as the objects of my investigation. It means I'm trying to get much more information or from my investigations about the biology and the ecology of fishes and nowadays especially about the uh, ongoing process of changing uh, of ichthyofauna not just of the adriatic sea even though of the mediterranean sea and um, if we i i think that we will uh, catch the time and I will show you uh, at the end uh, or maybe earlier, it depends on you uh, uh, and me, of course, uh, to say a few words about the uh, uh, changes which are now going on uh, in the whole Mediterranean era, in, uh, uh, especially in uh, uh, fish fauna, ichthyofauna. Uh, which are now, let's say that to the, today is uh, huge uh, changes are happening, especially in the eastern part of the Mediterranean Sea. And these uh, changes uh, make uh, some huge problems, especially if some of new invaders and non-indigenous species uh, became uh, invasive. There are many cases of such uh, changes, uh, especially of some kind of species. And uh, I will try to show you very shortly about these changes since I am, I worked on the uh, changes uh, and entrance of uh, new, new species, which mostly are coming from the Suez Channel and uh, such uh, species became uh, today uh, uh, members, such species became the member of the uh, Mediterranean ichthyofauna, and they made it some huge changes in uh, 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 food web. Okay, that's uh, about my uh, today occupations and uh, what I'm going, what I'm, trying to research and now I will go back uh, to the problem of which I'm teaching trying to pre present you since when I started when I was younger and I was a 
professor on the University of uh, Split. I had a colle uh, collegium, um, Marine Biology Resources, and I tried to uh, present to my uh, students uh, much more information about the whole about all the marine living resources. And now uh, I will try to uh, say about few words about this uh, uh, just for the uh, Adriatic Sea. So most of my presentation is the uh, is presented also in um, uh, one uh, monograph. The name of that. Uh, Monograph is a recent state, especially for the Mersory resources, recent state of the Mersory resources in the Adriatic Sea. And that monograph uh, was published in Acta Adriatica, a journal of the Institute of Oceanography and Fisheries. And um, uh, authors of this uh, monograph was Corrado Piccinetti, famous professor from, from Italy. Then Nedo Vergoc uh, from the Split Institute, Boan Marcetta from Slovenia, and Miss Chiara Manfredi. They prepared very nice uh, 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 monograph, and uh, practically I think that uh, 60 or 70 percent of, of this presentation is connected mostly um uh, with the uh, with that monograph recent state of the Mercer resources and uh, i will try to say just uh, much more words um about the pelagic resources which were which were prepared by most of the authors from both sides from even though uh, uh, including uh, experts from from slovenia okay uh Mm. If we try to say uh, generally uh, uh, about the 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 uh, Adriatic Sea, uh, we could say that in general, uh, Adriatic is a shallow sea. Uh, it's a semi-closed, elongated basin of the Central Mediterranean, and because of um, it's it's uh, deep penetration uh, into mainland and uh, in the shallowness practically it could be described as a continental uh, sea uh, estimated mean depth uh, is about 252 uh, uh, meters uh, about 70 percent of the bottom is less than 200 meters deep and the uh, depth um, uh, gradually increases from uh, uh, north to south and uh, 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 it extends about 800 kilometers from northwest to the southeast and uh, its wide range is from, is from let's say 90 to 220 kilometers it is connected uh, to the rest of the Mediterranean by the channel of Otranto, uh, let's say about um, uh, about uh, 40 nautical miles wide and uh, 780 meters deep, which plays a uh, very important role in the uh, circulation and exchange of water masses between the Adriatic and the Ionian Sea. Um, on this place, we at this time I just would like to mention that there are some theories uh, between uh, uh, old old theory about the ingressions of uh, waters from the Ionian sea to the into the adriatic and uh, such water uh, is as i learned about uh, it was a much more uh, warmer part of the of the mediterranean than adriatic so the input of uh, 
uh, warmer water uh, and uh, etc uh, increase uh, uh, the primary production and after that of course uh, secondary and um, nowadays uh, there is some kind of um, new uh, uh, let's say the construction of the that theory it is about the theory about the bimodal oscillation uh, it is also in general uh, some parts of the uh, old theory about the ingressions from the ionian to the to the uh, to the adriatic sea uh, has some kind of, let's say small modification modifications and uh, uh, there are now a theory uh, uh, of BIOS, B model oscillation system, which is in general in general same as like it was the theory of ingression waters. Uh, why am I spoken, speaking about this? Because it is nowadays very important uh, to know the circulation and impact uh, uh, of Ionian uh, Sea to the Adriatic Sea, and um, in very simplified to say there are now two type of gyres in the Ionian Sea when it is um, uh, it is connected with the eastern part of the Mediterranean and during such uh, uh, gyres which are in the Ionian Sea there are some parts of the year when um, uh, when this uh, type was uh, of waters which are entering there are some part uh, part of the effect of the levantine waters uh, and uh, in some time it is connected with the impact of the uh, waters which are coming from the uh, atlantic ocean or let's say much better to the western part of the mediterranean so such two types of waters are entering uh, in the adriatic sea changing uh, the 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 hydrographic uh, uh, moments and according to that in biota moments of of the Adriatic Sea and during the entrance of the uh, Levantine water uh, it is possible that uh, uh, in some part of the uh, of the period that uh, some organisms which are coming from the uh, uh, Swiss Channel are also entering during that time into the Adriatic Sea. And when this uh, type of waters are stopped and when started uh, another part, it is part when the waters from the uh, 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 waters from the uh, western side of the Mediterranean, let's say Atlantic waters, uh, uh, there are impacts of the uh, organisms which are entering through the Gibraltar, Gibraltar area or from the uh, uh, or, or from the Mediterranean uh, part, Western Mediterranean part of the of the uh, sea. So, uh, what to say again? Uh, uh, central part uh, uh, of basin reaches um, uh, maximum depth uh, in the Yavuka or let's say Pomo pit. It is the deepest part. I, I'm mentioning uh, this uh, very important part of the of the Adriatic. It is Yavuka or Pomo pit, and with the depth of 273 meters. Because you will see in the next uh, presentation uh, parts of, of that uh, very important place, which are mostly spawning area of very important demersal uh, demersal resources and uh, very important demersal species, which are. Uh, the part of uh, main parts of the um, of catches uh, which are uh, which are happening uh, especially uh, the merzel the merzel or troll uh, the merzel is also by trolls uh, in the southern part uh, this uh, let's say sub-regional area 17 uh, uh, gca 17 adriatic sea is deeper than 200 meter and uh, uh, the maximum uh, depth is about uh, 1,223 meter. This is, I think, the deepest uh, deepest point of the of the uh, Adriatic Sea. You see here on this uh, picture uh, 
that that what I already said in mid Adriatic pit or let's say Pomo pit, Yabuka pit. Then it is uh, Palagruja sill, uh, South Adriatic uh, pit, Strait of of Otranto, and very important impact of uh, Po uh, River Po uh, and its and its delta, which is very important for the northern part, not just for the northern part but for the whole Adriatic Sea. Um, uh, just to be back, uh, I forgot to say that um, uh, Northern and Central Adriatic uh, geographical subarea GCA 17 is one of the uh, largest and uh, best defined areas of occurrence of uh, both uh, uh, the Merzel and small pelagic shared stocks uh, in the Mediterranean area. Um, in, in this area, um, uh, uh, bottom troll fishing is well developed activity since the beginning of uh, 20th century along the whole along the whole basin. And the Merzel resources are exploited uh, by Italian, Croatian, and uh, uh, Slovenian fishing fleets, which often uh, often operate on the uh, uh, same uh, stocks and uh, fishing grounds. Uh, it is uh, what I already say, um, if you see uh, uh, um, for the purpose uh, of fisheries management, uh, uh, the fisheries of the Adriatic uh, is uh, divided in the two geographical uh, sub areas, 17, which include North and uh, North and Central Adriatic, and the GSE A18 Southern part of the Adriatic, and the countries which are included uh, in GSE uh, 18 is uh, uh, Montenegro and uh, uh, Croatia, Bosnia Herzegovina, Italy, and Slovenia bordered practically the the area. Sub area 70. Okay. Uh, Adriatic uh, Sea, together with the Gulf of Lyme, uh, is the coldest part of uh, uh, the Mediterranean wind, uh, with the winter temperatures below 10 uh, 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 degrees of Celsius in its northern part. Um, this is very important to know because uh, uh, if you if you already know that the northern part of the Adriatic is uh, 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 very very interesting, it means that uh, uh, one uh, great uh, 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 man from from Split, uh, Professor uh, from Zadar, pardon, uh, from Zadar, Spiridion Brusina made it uh, in 19th century a theory of boreal, uh, boreal theory that uh, in the Adriatic Sea, uh, the only part of the Mediterranean exists uh, a boreal uh, fauna. So practically it, his theory was uh, uh, very important because we know now that uh, such kind of uh, species, uh, fishes and other organisms are existing as boreal fauna in the northern part of the of the Adriatic, uh, this this will be seen. This is very important because if you uh, see in the mers of catches, there are differences uh, in catches in the mers in trolls, uh, for example, uh, between the northern and the southern uh, 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 part. Uh, or central and uh, southern part, because uh, complete uh, fauna is uh, uh, according to 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 uh, to that theory is practically uh, ma made it completely different. For example, uh, main main catch uh, in the mers uh, in trolls uh, uh, in uh, central and the southern part is hake, for example, and uh, in the northern part. For example, is Trisopterus minutus, Melangius melangius, a typical types of organisms which are connected with the with the uh, uh, colder colder water, uh, colder temperature. Uh, 
And the Adriatic Sea uh, is also a shallow sea compared to the if compared to the other parts of the Mediterranean. Uh, uh, um, three quarters of the sea bottom is less than 200 meter uh, depth. The depth, uh, what I already said, uh, uh, gradually decreases from south to the north. Uh, the Yavuka Pomo Pit, uh, 280 meter, 205, and the South Adriatic Pit is uh, the only areas deeper than 200 meter. There, therefore, most of the bottoms are on the, let's say, uh, the part which we call continental shelf, and a significantly a smaller part is on the continental slope, uh, uh, which are uh, less than 200 meter deep. E, I think that is all for this, uh, let's say, uh, uh, some characteristics about the, uh, 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 let's say, uh, most important parts of the characteristics of the Adriatic. Uh, just a few words um, about the bottom sediments, which are uh, mostly covered uh, with the recent muddy and uh, sandy sediments of uh, uh, different uh, mineral petrographic compositions and the granulometry, uh, 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 which transport highly depends on marine currents. Uh, the wide uh, uh, cyclonic circulation of waters uh, favorize the longitudinal dispersion of the sediments in basin coming from coast towards offshore. There is, a, let's say, a narrow belt of coastal sand up to five uh, or seven meter, meter depth. Then a mud belt, uh, 30 to 40 kilometers wide extensions southeastward along the Italian coast and up to reach the deeper deposits of the southern basin. Um, most uh, more offshore after transitional phases with sediments of various granulometry, there is also sand. Uh, muddy and uh, sandy uh, 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 sediment cover almost all the channel area of the Northeast uh, Adriatic and the Adriatic has enormous variety of benthic biomes. Uh, let's say that um, uh, Western side is mostly covered by sandy beaches and uh, muddy offshore bottoms and Eastern side shows, uh, uh, let's say more different uh, types of level bottom biocenosis. Okay, I know this is very boring, but <laughs> I need to, to mention because it is connected with the uh, living resources, because it is very important to know which kind of species are connected which, with which kind of uh, uh, sea bottom. Okay, uh, now we came to a very important uh, uh, factor is temperature, because uh, the temperature uh, regulate practically almost biological cycluses, life cycluses of, let's say, m most, most except uh, the mammals uh, of uh, marine organisms. Um, the surface uh, 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 waters undergo clear seasonal cycle, uh, cycle because maximum values are in summer, in, the, uh, in winter maximum mixed layer depth. In summer, the surface temperature is rather uniform over the complete, uh, over the complete Adriatic. Uh, the superficial temperature of the open sea waters is about 22 to 25 degrees Celsius, falling uh, to uh, 11.5 degrees near the bottom, let's say in the Yavuka, in the Yavuka pit or Pomo pit. North, uh, uh, North Adriatic, uh, uh, it, is in, uh, it is in that part, a well-developed thermocline, uh, and it is present in the spring and summer down to, let's say, about to 30 meter depth. 
in the middle uh, uh, Adriatic, the spring summer thermocline is, let's say, formed down to 50, 50 meters depth. Um, in some parts of the western coast and uh, in the northern uh, Adriatic, where the cooling of the whole water column occurs, waters can be colder than 11, what I already uh, uh, said in, in one part of my presentation. Let's say a few words about the uh, uh, salinity. Uh, in general, uh, if we, if we uh, uh, see uh, the Adriatic salinity, it is in general quite, we could say quite high, an average about uh, 38.3, which is uh, lower than in the Eastern Mediterranean, but uh, of course higher than in the Western part of the Mediterranean, where it is about, let's say, 37. Uh, generally, uh, we could say uh, it decreases from south to north and uh, 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 from open sea to the coast. Uh, south balance, uh, or let's say ba balance of salinity of uh, the server's layer is clearly affected by freshwater river runoff during the spring summer, of course. Of course, there is, there is the huge uh, rivers uh, from both sides, uh, especially, let's say, uh, River Po and uh, from the southern part, uh, from the eastern part, uh, uh, there is the river Neretva. Uh, and the, the effect uh, is, of course, uh, much more uh, exposed about in the, in the surface uh, uh, area and uh, there is a huge impact of freshwater river runoff. Uh, besides the normal um, annual variation, there are variations that uh, last uh, 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 several years. And it is, this is a result of the exchange of seawater masses between Adriatic and uh, uh, Eastern Mediterranean Sea. Uh, I think that uh, very important what I already said about my uh, about the mentions about the uh, ingressions and and and, uh, and now the uh, BIOS B model oscillation um, uh, system. In general uh, water masses circulation in the Adriatic uh, um, uh, Sea is dominated by typical uh, cyclonical moments. Uh, 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 the water masses inflow through the Strait of Otranto from the eastern Mediterranean along the eastern side and outflow along the western side. Uh, the general baroclinic circulation can be classified into current and uh, gyres with seasonal strength and occurrence and change uh, 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 special scales in different seasons. Uh, the wintertime uh, uh, conditions are characterized in the first uh, 100 meter of depth by a wide uh, uh, northward flow field, probably associated with intense uh, but shallow return Yet jets along the east, western, sorry, western coastline. Uh, while in the other seasons, coastal currents develop, particularly during the autumn, along the eastern coast. Uh, the western uh, uh, side of the Adriatic basin is a site of intense current segments, which are disconnected in uh, free, uh, in free. Uh, sub basins in spring and summer. Uh, the autumn condition shows an overall, overall cyclonic circulation with the intensification of free cyclonic gyres in the sub basins. Oh, sorry. Um, now uh, we should 
say about few words about the sorry biodiversity of the Adriatic uh, 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 Sea. You can see here fishes, crustaceans, and cephalopods. For the whole world, you see more than 28,000 uh, species uh, for crustaceans, uh, more than 12,000, and for, uh, for, for uh, mollusks, more than 80, 800. I think that, of course, uh, this changes all, all, all the time. Uh, for the whole Mediterranean, it's uh, about uh, six, uh, 660 species for, for fish, uh, about 340 for the, for the uh, uh, crabs, and uh, 51 for, for, for cephalopods, mollusks. And uh, for the Adriatic, you can see here, this, this number is always uh, exposed to, to changes. Of course, especially nowadays when, when uh, new species enter or some new is described for the first time. Uh, but it is around, let's say, 440 uh, 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 species today about with the, connected with the fish species. Uh, uh, crabs is about 241 and uh, uh, 41 for the cephalopods or mollusks. Um, uh, special, uh, or let's say better to say, uh, uh, the unique uh, nature of the Adriatic gives rise to an abundance of endemic uh, flora and fauna. Uh, 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 the data from the uh, 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 Croatian National uh, Biodiversity Strategy Action Plan they 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 uh, identified more than uh, for example more than 7000 animal of and, and plant species in the adriatic sea um, uh, uh, also uh, 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 some rare and threatened species uh, are found along the adriatic especially uh, eastern coast adriatic's eastern coast it is since it is a relatively clearer and less polluted than the western uh, uh, Adriatic coast, in in part because what I already said uh, that because the sea currents flow flow through the Adriatic in a counterclockwise direction, uh, bringing uh, according to that waters up. Uh, uh, the eastern coast and returning increasingly polluted water down the the western coast. Um, in um, uh, general, uh, 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 marine uh, biodiversity in the Adriatic is attributed to its geological history, uh, limited by its present bathymetric, hydrographic, and climatic characteristics, and uh, influenced by present geographical connectivity and anthropogenic processes. Uh, these characteristics have been crucial in, uh, for example, in shaping uh, uh, the peculiarities of the, the specialities, so let's say, of uh, uh, Adriatic ichthyofauna, Although it is a part uh, of the Mediterranean, Adriatic Sea is an independent, we could say is an independent biogeographical and ecological subunit of the, uh, of the Mediterranean, which is evident in the, uh, 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 in the composition and uh, properties of its biological community. In general, uh, we could say that the uh, Mediterranean Sea is a hot spot in everything, let's say. The impact of, uh, uh, of uh, uh, fishing gears, the impact of, uh, of tourism 
during the especially during the the summer time uh, the impacts of huge uh, uh, rivers uh, uh, especially uh, uh, or for example uh, Nile in Egypt etc so practically uh, in general the marine uh, biodiversity of the complete uh, Mediterranean Sea, sea and including of, of course of the Adriatic is uh, uh, currently facing uh, to substation substantial changes in its flora and fauna uh, and it is uh, rapidly changing due to the increasing arrival of uh, non-indigenous fishes and other taxa and especially if uh, uh, such uh, uh, species became invasive and most of uh, uh, of uh, uh, especially fishes which came to the mediterranean area uh, became invasive because uh, this is the uh, what we say the problem uh, with the um, changing in uh, in food web because when some kind of species which had some uh, uh, special type of uh, 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 adaptation and uh, biology for example high high very high fecundity uh, it is poison it it, it complete it's um, it is for example poison uh, fish or, or whatever uh, uh, and such type of, of characteristics uh, support uh, uh, for example uh, species which became in the uh, areas uh, of the mediterranean invasive it means uh, it could uh, be dangerous uh, for consum consumption. Uh, it could be dangerous in in, in uh, fishing industry. It means especially in uh, um, where is the uh, when a fisherman uh, uh, is uh, taking a net from the from the sea, he can be uh, 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 touched or he could be touched uh, some kind of species which has. Uh, uh, a problem with the with the poison in, in the skin or whatever for example lagocephalus uh, some kind of species which is poison is full of poison and uh, even though if you touch the, the skin you can be dangerous to 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 die so such uh, 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 changes are very rapid and uh, some of the species entered into the also into the Adriatic, and uh, we always said some uh, some notes uh, to the to the uh, community to be uh, in danger, to be in uh, preparation for such possibility, and uh, we will try to get uh, the much more info and uh, about the species, and we will try to investigate. Uh, uh, if we will be in possibility to investigate the biology of uh, such invasive species which which enter uh, in new in a new area especially in the new 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 habitats and uh, we will see what will be on and uh, i will try to show you some in next presentation if we will have enough time to 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 present it some kind of such uh, fish species um uh, let's say that uh, during the the last few decades uh, uh, some uh, different factors uh, uh, including climate change uh, anthropogenic activity uh, uh, and reception migration uh, have changed the composition uh, not just uh, adriatic ichthyofauna but complete uh, 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 fauna of the of the uh, uh, especially eastern part of the mediterranean but also of, of uh, complete fauna of the adriatic uh, um, while uh, this here you can see uh, uh, reception migration uh, for example it is uh, responsible uh, for the arrival of uh, non-indigenous species through the Suez Channel and uh, mm, climate change, for example, has caused northward spreading of uh, 
southern thermophilus species, a process known of, uh, as meridionalization. Such these two types of, of, of processes could affect uh, the, the, the uh, uh, fauna, also not just fauna, but and also in flora uh, of, of, of uh, the areas. You see here the Suez uh, uh, Channel, and uh, uh, there is also a process of anti Lesseps migration, but it is not so uh, hard. It means that it is not so evident transport of species from the uh, uh, south, uh, north, uh, um, eastern part of the Mediterranean into the Red Sea. A huge number of species, including all, all, uh, all the members of the, of the fauna, uh, is going from the Suez Channel to the eastern part, then to the Ionian Sea, and then enter to the Adriatic. Here is one kind of barrier between the, let's say, eastern and the western part uh, of the Mediterranean. And most of these invasive uh, species pass this barrier and also enter into the western part, uh, western part of the Mediterranean. One of uh, uh, most recent uh, new members of the Adriatic uh, See is species which I'm showing now. Just a moment. Um, uh, Teres miles, a uh, uh, devil fish or whatever. Uh, 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 it is a, a, a very aggressive kind of, of of species, which now occupy all the eastern part of the Mediterranean. Uh, also pass this barrier between the eastern and and uh, uh, western side and there are now i think one two three four five five specimens uh, found in the in the uh, adriatic uh, one one was found here nearby the island of vis and two were found down there uh, near bari and one is uh, was found also in Albania, and one was found in Montenegro coast. So practically, if these species enter uh, through the old, old parts, it could make a, a huge uh, chaos in 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 um, in fauna of domestic uh, uh, species because it is very aggressive. And I, I will stop now here about that. Okay. Uh, uh, we must go on. Uh, a few words about the fisheries um, activities, uh, which is uh, conducted within the area of the of the uh, 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 Adriatic uh, Sea. Uh, if we touch the fishing type of fishing type gears. Um, for example, uh, two kinds uh, of uh, fishing gears are currently used to catch the uh, uh, small pelagic species. It, mainly it is anchovy, Engraulis and Crassicholus, uh, and sardine, Sardina pelagus, in the Adriatic Sea. And the most used by uh, the Italian fleet is the uh, domestic name Volante. Uh, midwater pelagic uh, trawl net towed by two vessels, mostly operated in the non uh, in the uh, northern and cent central areas of the Adriatic. Um, these vessels uh, 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 fish only by uh, daytime and uh, land their product uh, every evening. The fishing trips. Uh, last about 11 or 14 hours catch is up to for example or about 15 tons per couple of boats per day what was recorded and uh, in the late 70s and early 80s and at present maximum catch is about the uh, four tons per day you see here uh, 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 the construction of uh, of, of uh, 
and this type of uh, pelagic troll net. Until the mid 60s, uh, the main gear which was used to catch small pelagic species was a light attraction, poor same. And uh, it is um, still in use in uh, 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 the Gulf of uh, Trieste and uh, much more south of the Ancona on the western side. And it's the main gear used in Slovenia, Croatia, Montenegro and Albania. Uh, 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 the Italian Pursin has an uh, uh, operate mainly in the uh, central Adriatic and in the Gulf of Trieste. They fish by night in good weather conditions, attracting uh, 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 fish with lights. Uh, uh, their activity is often, but not always, suspending during the colder month, months. Uh, in Croatia, uh, uh, there is a fishing ban from 15 December till the 15 uh, January. Uh, it depends also uh, when these main species is uh, is spawning uh, and it could be changed uh, this uh, this 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 uh, period but mostly is from 15 december till 15 january and i think that now according to uh, i didn't check it um, but I, I i'm sure that they, they made it a, a new fishing ban for the for the period when uh, when uh, anchovy is spawning and Raulis, uh, it is, uh, let's say, I think that it started in in um, May. I think it started in May. Um, we have um, uh, fishing activities uh, which are concerning um, uh, the bluefin tuna, uh, which is offshore pools same fishing activities uh, is a very important part of the uh, pelagic fishery within the Adriatic Sea. In uh, Croatia, uh, poor seine is a principal, principal fishing gear used for its uh, capture. Uh, and the principal fishing grounds for, uh, for Croatian poor seiners are the offshore, offshore waters uh, of the central part of the Adriatic Sea. Uh, and after capture, they are transferred into floating uh, towing cages. This is done in the open sea where the catch has occurred by simply joining boat nets under the sea surface. Once the cages are filled with the exactly number of tuna, they, uh, with the right, let's say, number of tuna, they are slowly towed and tug boat towards the farming locations. The distance um, between uh, the fishing ground and the farming location can vary from a few to several hundred of miles if the fish catch occurs outside the Adriatic Sea. Okay. Uh, we could say that the uh, 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 Adriatic Sea is one of the largest, uh, sorry, is the largest area of occurrence of the Mersel and the small pelagic shared stocks in the whole Mediterranean. And we could say that the main uh, small pelagic species are sardine, uh, sardina firhardus, anchovy, uh, and graulis, and classicolis, uh, horse mackerel, trahurus, mackerel scomber, and in the northern area, uh, sprat, spratus, spratus is found, although it was much more evident during the 60s and 70s uh, than nowadays. Mostly uh, uh, Spratus is collected uh, from the eastern side, catched in the eastern side, and it is still present on the fish markets 
in the northern part, uh, northeastern part of the of the of the Adriatic Sea. Uh, it lives on the continental shelf uh, uh, from 10 to to 50 meter depth, and uh, uh, and uh, um, uh, it is, uh, I think, according to my knowledge, is the only area in the Adriatic where uh, Spratus is uh, uh, spawning, so practically in front of of Quarner region and uh, islands in the and islands in the northern part of the Adriatic from the eastern side. Um, the dominant the dominant uh, uh, fish species in terms of biomass on the continental shelf completely in the Adriatic are, uh, uh, let's say, uh, a red mallet, Mulus barbatus, poor caught Trisopterus minutus, uh, some various species of triglids, then uh, solea, solea, sole, uh, various species of flat fishes, gobies, and uh, 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 Pandoras, means Pagellus. Uh, for from uh, 50 to 100 meter uh, depth, uh, and there are anglerfish, Lophius, uh, uh, European hake, Merlutius, Merlutius, um, greater fork beard, Fitzis brenoides, and uh, Cepola red bandfish, Cepola rubescens, I think it's, they always change the name, Latin name, Cepola rubescens or so Cepola uh, uh, macrophthalma. It depends on uh, the results of taxonomists. Uh, also evident as uh, another uh, type of fishes, or let's say uh, uh, target, uh, target species is blue whitening, Micromesistius, so at 100 to 200 meter uh, depth. Um, the continental, we could say that the continental shelf of the uh, Adriatic uh, 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 Sea is also rich in uh, invertebrate uh, uh, fauna, where some of the most uh, evident species are cattlefish, uh, two type of species dominate, sepia officinaris and uh, sepia elegans. Uh, uh, octopuses, let's, uh, Ledone moschata, uh, Ledone cirosa and octopus vulgaris, squids, uh, loligo vulgaris and uh, aloteotis media, um, mantis shrimps, uh, uh, for example, Squilla mantis and um, uh, Parapenea aeus longirostris, then Norway lobster, Nephrops norvegicus, and some scallops, Pecten uh, jacobeus, and Hlamis opercularis. Uh, we have come back on the type of uh, of uh, fishing gears, uh, classical bottom trolls are used to fish uh, the males of species uh, like uh, red mullets, uh, like octopuses, sepias, squillas. Why uh, another bottom gear? Uh, uh, the name uh, is Rapido. I think that most of you uh, knows that type of of, of uh, gear and it, uh, it is used for the demersal fishery. Practically this gear is dredge composed by uh, uh, an anterior rigid metallic framework, uh, a wooden uh, table acting as a depressor and maintaining the mouth in a close contact with the sea bottom. And, uh, and the serious uh, uh, of iron teeth that penetrate into the sediment. Um, uh, uh, Rapido is used to catch uh, flatfishes and Norway lobsters. This gear is uh, used offshore to fish mainly clams and other mollusks. 
uh, 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 bottom trolls and rapido trolls induce several sublethal and lethal damages of uh, non-target species. Uh, 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 from the, on the Croatian side, um, along the Croatian coast, bottom troll fisheries is mainly regulated by special and temporal fisheries regulation measures, and uh, about uh, the thir third, one third of territorial sea is closed for bottom troll fisheries over the whole year. Also, uh, uh, bottom uh, troll fisheries closed half a year in the uh, majority of the inner sea. And uh, in, on the Croatian side, a rapido type of rapido troll is uh, allowed only to catch mollusks, practically one family pectinide. Oh, uh, yes, let me go enter to the another part. Um, evidence of uh, transboundary and the uh, stranding nature of some important uh, resources may be drawn from the geographical uh, occurrence pattern of several stocks, which are high various stocks targeted by the Adriatic demersal fishery. In fact, beyond the 12 miles zone, all the resources are potentially shared among the national fleets that operate in the international sea. The, the highest densities of, for example, Norway lobster are in the uh, uh, Pomo pit and in other areas deeper than 100 meters. A low densities, but bigger size growing individuals, or faster growing individuals, are found in muddy bottom shallower than 100 meters in the central north, northern part of the Adriatic. And uh, intermediate densities are also found around and between the above two areas. We now come um, uh, uh, to the uh, one of the most uh, important, uh, what I already mentioned, uh, 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 areas and uh, habitats for uh, 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 some shared demersal stocks of the Adriatic uh, uh, Sea. Um, even though it covers less than 10% uh, of the total uh, surface of the Adriatic Sea, it is uh, one of the most important fishing grounds, especially for the bottom trout fishery which apply a high fishing pressure on the resources of the area. Uh, uh, the bottom of the uh, Pomo pit is characterized by uh, two, two contiguous areas, uh, the Fossa Centrale or, or, or Pomo Yavoca pit of more than 200 meters uh, depth, which is largely situated within the Croatian territorial waters. Towards the Italian coast, there is a second depressed uh, uh, area, the western Pomo pit, which with depths greater than 200 meters, called, called the Fondaletto and separated from the Pomo pit by a sill. Uh, and uh, for example, uh, 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 Pomo pit has been the subject, especially nowadays, the subject of uh, of numerous uh, scientific investigations on both sides of the of the Adriatic. Uh, the Pomo pit um, is a region where cold uh, uh, nutrient uh, uh, reach waters from the northern Adriatic flow near the bottom and get trapped by the bottom shape. It has thus uh, uh, waters with more nutrients near the bottom than near surface waters. These, uh, these conditions uh, encourage a high evidence of fish and shellfish, and the area has long been known as a productive fishing ground due to the high presence of some species whose stocks are commercially important, like, such like as Hake, Melutius, 
shrimps, Norway lobsters and cephalopods. In addition, we could say that the pomo pit is an, a very important or the main nursery area for the many denazal species and uh, in particular for the stock of hake in the northern and central Adriatic. It is distant 40 nautical miles from the Italian coast and it extends inside the Croatia territorial waters. The area is easily, for example, reached by fishing vessels from Italian fishing ports between Ancona and Termoli and uh, from the Croatian side from ports between uh, uh, Zara, Zadar and Makarska. Okay. Uh, I am suggesting now 10 minutes of uh, break because my my lips and my mouth is uh, need some water. Okay. Okay, Jakob, I see you in 10 minutes. 10 minutes, please. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Bye. Uh, okay, we will start now. Uh, I need to say uh, a few words about the uh, uh, mollusks uh, fishery production uh, in the Adriatic uh, area. And, um, according to FAO fish stat database, uh, uh, bivalve mollusks fishery seems to be uh, quite significant in the Adriatic area especially in the uh, northwest basin, where uh, best, best luck, uh, and the trophic conditions for propagation of these species, uh, major rivers uh, flowing into this part of the, uh, uh, of the Adriatic Sea, together with extended lagoons along the coast and the muddy and sandy bottoms, uh, uh, which are characterized by minor slopes uh, and are the main factors that uh, make uh, this area uh, 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 rich in biocenosis with important uh, uh, mollusks, uh, bival mollusks species. Uh, uh, for example, uh, in this, uh, it is worthwhile to, to cite the uh, uh, the presence of extended uh, uh, anandara in equivalvis. The beds on Alochtonus site, the presence of the extended anandara in equi, uh, 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 which uh, were involuntarily introduced into the Adriatic towards the end of the 60s. That uh, now uh, proliferate between one and ten miles from miles from the coast and uh, still uh, not uh, found uh, a valuable market utilization. Uh, uh, mussels are usually harvested, uh, let's say collected by hand and the less frequently were rich mussels bed on lagoon bottoms uh, through bottom troll fishery. The most exploited areas are the ones close to the rocky coastal parts, among which Conero promor promontory in the Mar Che region stands out. Equally important are the quantities collected of methane producing platforms during cleaning and maintenance activities. Clumps are usually uh, caught by uh, uh, vessels equipped with the hydraulic dredge. In 2000, for example, out of seven, two, uh, 728 dredge boats registered in Italy, seven 685 were operative along the Adriatic coast. This fishery system operates on sandy bottoms with one mile from the coast. Uh, normative applied to this capture system contains the following indications. Gears dimensions, catches limit, vessels dimensions, engine power, clamp size, etc. Fishing areas are managed by compartmental management consortiums to which all fishermen are affiliated. Some of these vessels are used 
or other bivalve mollusks fisheries as well such as smooth calista, calista hione, and razor claims, for example, solen and ensis. Production uh, is around uh, 30,000 uh, 30, uh, tons per year. Eastern uh, coastal clams production is, uh, uh, is only reported for Albania, Albania, referring to the period from 1987 to 1996. The trend uh, shows a progressive decrease from the initial amount of 700 uh, tons, according to FAO fish study. Although reduced clam beds are uh, present along the northern coast of this country, collection of any kind is not allowed. In Croatia, for example, particularly in the northern Adriatic, along the Istrian Peninsula coast, a uh, very important species is Pectenia cobeus, uh, uh, targeted by a good part of the fleet uh, using dredges. In other areas, the capture fisheries of Pectinidae has nowadays become mar marginal. In the past, Pectinidae species were collected in the northern Adriatic with the bottom troll gears called rapidi, rapido, vessels equipped with the fixed dredges originally constructed, firstly, or the flat fish fisheries. Uh, uh, that there is a high number of um, exploited uh, of number of species exploited by the demersal fishery. Uh, 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 what does it mean? That that means that it uh, the number of uh, uh, the high number characterize the Adriatic fisheries as well as uh, Mediterranean fisheries in general. And that makes um, uh, 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 exploitation as, or let's say, uh, 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 the marital fishery is remarkably multi-specific. As it has been said before, the Adriatic is probably the largest and the best defined area of occurrence of shared stocks in the whole Mediterranean area. Uh, um, the most important demersal uh, and the small pelagic commercial species whose stocks are shared in the Adriatic were identified and agreed upon the regional, uh, by the regional experts, uh, convened by the Adria Med FAO regional project. Uh, um, uh, uh, recognition of the shared stock status of the priority species was uh, subsequently proposed by the, the uh, national management authorities of Albania, Croatia, Italy, and Slovenia, and uh, then endorsed at the 28th session of GFCM, General Fisheries Council for the Mediterranean in 2003. Uh, now we will say about a uh, few words about the pelagic main species. Uh, uh, small uh, 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 pelagic fish species are uh, uh, widely distributed in the Adriatic Sea and play an important role in the commercial fisheries of all countries located along the coast of the Adriatic Sea. The main species uh, of uh, small pelagic are uh, sardine, sardina pirhadus, anchovy and graulis, and crassiholus, Atlantic mackerel, scomber, scombrus, chub mackerel, scomber japonicus, and the sprat, spratus, spratus. Other species also, also occasionally caught in small pelagic fisheries in the Adriatic are uh, the horse mackerel, trahurus, trahurus. Then, uh, 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 Trachurus mediterraneus, uh, uh, sand smelt, Mediterranean sand smelt, Aterina hepsetus, uh, pitcherer, blotched pitcherer, spicara maena, and uh, boog, boops, boops. Uh, anchovies and uh, sardines are fished by poor sailors, attracting fish by light, and pelagic trolls belonging to, uh, uh, trolls belonging to Italy, Croatia, and Slovenia. The fishery takes place all year around. Closure period is observed for the Italian pelagic trawlers on August, while the 
closure is from 15, what I said already, December to 15 January in Croatia. Uh, uh, pelagic uh, uh, fishing fleet activity on the eastern uh, part of the Adriatic has always been directed mostly at Sardis, and the Croatian catches represent the main part of the total catches. Small pelagic fishes are the main fisheries resources of the Adriatic Sea, accounting for a large share of the total of the total catches. Uh, the group represented approximately 46% of the total marine catches of the, of the Adriatic, for example, for the period from the 2000, uh, 2000 to 2010, being 99% of this total accounted for by sardine and anchovy. So sardine and anchovy are the most abundant and economically important small pelagic species in the Adriatic Sea with stock regularly assessed by GFCM and uh, uh, FAO Adria Med uh, working group on small pelagics. Uh, for example, I was that um, the member of the Adria Med working group, but not uh, in previous times I was on that small pelagics, but now I'm from the, for the um, uh, coastal. Uh, resources. So I'm, I was the member of the FAO Adria Med working group, but in previous times for small pelagics, but now I think that uh, part of the uh, Adria Med uh, group is, uh, is finishing uh, there. I think that they're finishing now their activities. Um, let's go on. Uh, a general overview of um, capture fisheries landing trends from the Adriatic over 40 years, from 1970 until 2011, can be extracted uh, from the open access uh, FAO stati stati statistics fish stats software. In uh, this database, the reliability of nominal landing can differ greatly between the countries and regions. It cannot be easily assessed. However, these, uh, these data roughly outline the, the fisheries production performance of the uh, complete region. Um, historically, uh, the Eastern Adriatic countries uh, uh, targeted mainly sardine, but uh, since the mid 90s, there has been an increase of anchovy uh, catches in the east, uh, specifically by, by Croatia. Uh, total catch of sardine increased uh, steadily between uh, 1970 and 1981, when the maximum uh, was recorded at uh, around uh, uh, 90,000 uh, 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 tons. This was followed by a sharp decrease between 1982 and 1995. Uh, um, the war in the former uh, country, Yugoslavia, from 1990 to 1995 was one important uh, factor that affected the fisheries from the eastern part, uh, from the eastern Adriatic countries in that period. Uh, catches uh, remain below um, uh, 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 40,000 tons since then, with uh, two peaks in 1998 and uh, two, uh, 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 2010 of about uh, 300, uh, 300 uh, uh, tons, uh, 36, sorry, tons. Uh, data from the northern and central Adriatic, from the area subregion and area 17 for 2011 indicate that catches have continued to increase in more, more recent years. The Eastern Adriatic fishery, which was uh, 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 represented uh, by the Yugoslavia uh, Republic until the independence of Croatia and Slovenia in 1991, uh, experienced a marked decline between 1990 and 1995, followed by a period of increasing catches by 
uh, Croatia until two, 2010. Italy accounted for a large share of the catches until the early 90s declining in importance since then. And in, in 2010, Italy reported uh, 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 six, uh, six uh, uh, hundred and eighty-eight tons of uh, sardine, Croatia 29, uh, 600, uh, and Slovenia 403 four tons. Catches by Montenegro and uh, what was before, I don't know, Serbia and Montenegro as represents uh, uh, ex-Yugoslavia, one part of Yugoslavia, and be, have been below 100, 100 tons with Montenegrin catches of uh, 35 tons in 2000 and, and 2010. Um, for example, uh, in 2011, the closure season for the Italian fleet was extended to 60 days, August and September. Pelagic catch dominated the marine fish landing, particularly in the eastern part and in the east coast fishery, even though from the mid 80s, the contribution of pelagics of total fish landings decreased remarkably as a consequence of the successive downsizing of the anchovy and sardine stocks and more recently, of the economic changes which took place in the eastern coastal countries. Uh, anchovy catches increased between uh, uh, 70s and 1974, uh, 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 re reaching about uh, uh, 42,900 tons, decreased to 18,100 tons in 1977. Increasing sharply in the following two years, the fishery attained its maximum historical level. In 1979, uh, uh, when uh, 62, for 62 tons were landed. Uh, uh, catches collapsed afterwards, reaching the historical minimum in 1987, 755 tons. The collapse of fishery was followed by a period of relative uh, stability in catches, which oscillated around uh, 10,000 tons per year from 88 to uh, 92. The fishery experienced uh, a recovery since then, reaching a peak of reaching the peak uh, in 2006. Catches declined after that being about uh, 46,000 uh, per year in 90, uh, uh, 2009 and 2010. Data from the Northern and Central Adriatic for 2011 indicate that catches have continued to decline. That is important to, to remember. Uh, the Merzel main species. Uh, it the fishery, the merged fishery takes place uh, on the entire continental shelf on the part of the continental slope in the southern part. Most of the fishing activities carried out by the trawlers and the use of fixed gear is usually limited to the area unsuitable for trawling. Uh, the merged fishery is multi species fishery, and the main target species are European hake. Uh, 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 Merluzius, Merluzius, Red Mallet, uh, Murus Barbatus, uh, Pagelus, Pagelus Breams, Whitening, Melangius Melangus, the, uh, Anglerfish, Lophius, Flatfish, Sola Vulgaris, Pseta Maxima, Scotalmus Rhombus, Patictis Flesus, Eradone, Common cat Cattlefish, Sopia Ficinaris, Squids, Norway lobster and deep water rose shrimp, Parapenaeus longirostris. Um, the Marzal fishery, what I said, I think, in the previous uh, presentation, part of the presentation, was um, this uh, 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 difference between the troll catches and the Marzal fishery and the main, main uh, species which were inside. So practically, uh, 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 more uh, in the part of uh, 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 more southern than than uh, northern part, so practically central and and uh, southern part 
the catches are uh, mostly uh, by by uh, the main catches are mostly connected with the Merluzius uh, uh, and Mulus, for example, and uh, of the northern part is connected with the Merlangius and uh, and uh, and whitening Merlangius and flatfish solar. Uh, practically, uh, that was connected with the. Uh, and of course, for the southern nephros. So practically, that is that uh, that is uh, connected with this difference between the uh, 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 boreal fauna, which, for example, the member of the boreal is Melangius melangus, yeah? and and uh, 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 for example, a uh, more southern part, uh, which is connected with the Merluzius. So practically, that is that uh, theory of 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 uh, Boreal existence of uh, of boreal species uh, in the in the Adriatic Sea. So there is a difference between inside the Mercer fishery between northern and the southern part of the of the Adriatic. Uh, um, uh, the Hake uh, is the, uh, is largely distributed in the in the Adriatic, uh, ex uh, excepted in the. Uh, uh, in the northern part of GSCA 17, north of the uh, of the mouth of the Po River, and coastal shallow waters, uh, the juveniles of the Hake uh, are concentrated in the middle Adriatic around the 150 uh, 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 meters depth, while adult individuals are commonly found at the depths greater than 250 meters. This species in, is mainly caught by trawlers, but it is also frequently present in the catches of gill nets and entangling nets. In the Adriatic, uh, 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 practically hake, Adriatic hake spawns, uh, spawns throughout the year, but with a different uh, intensity, intensity. So uh, uh, the peak uh, 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 spawning uh, takes place in winter and summer. Uh, uh, in the Pomo pit, uh, the first deposition occurs in winter in the in the deep waters up to to 200 meters and in the period between spring and uh, uh, and summer uh, spawning takes place in shallower water uh, uh, um, according to the nursery areas the nursery areas are located on the slopes in areas uh, advanced to the pomo pit and depths between uh, uh, between uh, 150 and 200, 200 meters. Uh, another species is uh, 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 Norway lobster, Nephrops norvegicus, is widely distributed in the central and uh, uh, and the northern Adriatic at the depths of more than uh, 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 50 meters. But the most important densities uh, of this species are located on Pomo pit grounds. Um, uh, juveniles are concentrated in, uh, uh, in deep areas over the 200 meters. And there are substantial differences in average length between the population of the Pomo pit and those of the rest of the Adriatic. And these differences are the result of the diversity of ecological factors which lead to a reduction in the growth of nephrops and other, of course, and other benthic decapods in the pomo pit. Another species is the red mullet, uh, Mullus barbatus, is uh, distributed all over the GSCA 17 and, uh, and uh, performs uh, seasonal migrations. Uh, uh, the the uh, adult uh, population is distributed along the central and eastern part of the of the Adriatic, while the the juveniles are found in the uh, western coastal area, where it remains until the early winter, and then moves to the depths of the sea. Uh, the species is mainly fished by uh, bottom troll nets from both sides from Italian and Croatian fleet. Smaller uh, quantities of Mulus barbatus uh, are also caught with Italian tremel uh, 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 nets and gill nets. 
Slovenian catches are low, only two tons reported, for example, in 2007. A closure of 45 days in late summer has been enforced in the period, for example, 2011 and 2012 for the Italian fleet before 2011, the closure period was 30 days in, in summer period. Uh, another species is um, the common solar. Uh, solar vulgaris is a species which is distributed in the northern and the center Adriatic, uh, depending on the age of, of uh, specimens. Uh, uh, the other specimens are uh, present along the coast of the Istria, uh, on the eastern part, Istrian coast, while the younger ones are present in the Italian coastal waters, especially at the mouth of the river Po. Uh, the majority of the population moves from north to south along the Italian coast and probably from south to north along the eastern coast. Uh, and the highest catches occur in the fall. Another uh, 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 specimen is uh, species, pardon, uh, uh, is the deep water rose shrimp, Parapenaeus longirostris. Uh, 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 is a, this species is an important species in the demersal troll fishery of the whole geographical sub area 18 as it is distributed mainly in the southern part of the Adriatic. It is not very evident uh, 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 in the central part, with the exception of Pomo Pit, where it is uh, present mainly on muddy bottoms between 130 and 119 feet deep. Another very interesting species is uh, 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 is the uh, squilla mantis, the mantis shrimp. Uh, 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 it is um, distributed over a wide band uh, uh, parallel to the coast between 15 and 70 meter depth in the upper and middle Adriatic. Uh, uh, in this area, mm, squilla mantis is, is exploited by a uh, bottom otter troll gill net and rapido trout. This species is exploited all year round essentially by the Italian trawlers and uh, ranks first among the crustacean landed in the Adriatic ports. The Slovenian annual landings are much lower while in Croatian landings uh, statistics this species is absent even though I know that it uh, is um, uh, it is connected with the. Uh, it, it, you can find the squilla mantis. Uh, you can find it on the on the fish markets, especially uh, 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 along the along the Istrian western western coast of Istria Peninsula. Uh, uh, Troll uh, 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 catch is mainly composed by uh, age one and uh, two individuals while uh, the older uh, uh, age classes are poorly represented in the catch. As according to, as concerns the uh, uh, artisanal uh, fisheries, uh, Squilamant is, is alternate target of gill netters targeting solar solar, especially during spring summer seasons in the coastal area. The, spe uh, the species is not present in the list of uh, share stocks of GFCM as it is present and commercially fished mainly in the Italian territorial waters, but I said it also, it is uh, fished by uh, Italian, uh, Croatian, also by Croatian territorial, uh, Croatian territorial waters. Uh, a few words about the status of the, uh, uh, of the stocks. Uh, according to small pelagic resources, anchovy uh, 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 in GSEA uh, 17. Um, uh, main uh, in Italian fishing harbors for anchovies in the Adriatic harbors can be, for example, considered Trieste, Chioggia, Porto Garibaldi, Cesenatico, Rimini, 
uh, Ancona, San Benedetto del Tronto. And these harvests, for example, about 85% of the catch of anchovy is landed. Other important uh, uh, harvests are Grado, uh, Goro, Fano, and Giulianova. Anchovy landings during the last 30 years are characterized by two major factors. The landing peak of more than uh, 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 50,000 tons in 1981 and the subsequent decline to the minimum of 10,000 tons in 1987, which lasted till the early 90s. Since then, yield has been constantly increasing. Uh, um, whether uh, anchovy in the Adriatic is part of one or two stocks is uncertain. The hypothesis of two um, distinct populations is based on morphometric and allozemic differences between northern and southern Adriatic anchovy. Uh, uh, this hypothesis has not been supported by more recent genetic data. For stock assessment purposes, anchovy caught in the GSC 17 in the northern central Adriatic has been considered part of a single stock and has been assessed separately from the stock in GSC A18. Uh, I was the member of team uh, uh, which started to make uh, uh, assessment of biomass uh, 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 of anchovy. Uh, when I started to work in the institute uh, here in uh, early 80s, in no early 90, 90s, and I started to to use uh, one method. Uh, mm, uh, which were used for stock assessment of anchovy. Uh, and I used the uh, uh, production of uh, uh, egg, uh, eggs and larvae of, of, uh, of anchovy. And, and um, you know that there are some other methods. Uh, uh, and I used practically ichthyoplankton surveys to, to make a, 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 a uh, assessment of the of the biomass of the of the anchovy you know that there are also indirect catch and effort and the vpa method but i used uh, when i started to work ichthyoplankton survey and um, i'm so proud that i was uh, one uh, who for the first time uh, i used one very specific method uh, that was the uh, i tried to I tried to uh, calculate uh, 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 how old uh, were the larvae of anchovy by the method of reading uh, otoliths from the uh, larvae of the anchovy. And uh, I, I think that I was the second one who for the first time used this type of method and to calculate uh, according to the rings which formed in the in the in the small small otoliths of larvae is like as you have one of the methods which were which were uh, 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 in the standardized uh, fisheries biology when you read otoliths uh, uh, practically uh, uh, it is some kind of difference between uh, to cal calculating the uh, the age reading by the otoliths of larvae uh, and uh, you can uh, practically you read daily daily increments and according to that you are able to calculate on to 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 get info how old are the larva of the anchovy in days on the basis of daily increments and if you know that for this type of method you practically you know everything to, and you have all the data which you need to calculate to calculate the biomass uh, with this type of method. And also you need to have the data about the fecundity in that time, according to the analyzing uh, the adult specimens and to calculate the fecundity. And with this data about the 
the, 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 the data about the daily uh, age in days, you can calculate everything what you need to, to, to uh, uh, see what will be, how much the evidence of biomass, the evidence of biomass of the NGV will be. So practically I published something, something around the 90s, early 90s in two journals about this. And um, I was so happy that my method was good and uh, that uh, uh, I was one of the er earliest who calculate the biomass on the basis of the ichthyoplankton survey. And I was the first one who calculated the age of the larvae of the anchovy in the, in the Adriatic. Okay. Uh, mm, in the GSCA uh, 17, the trend of uh, biomass uh, of anchovy increased until 2005. And then it comes decrease until uh, uh, 2009. And the 10 then increases again. The 2011 spawning stock biomass estimate is between uh, 309,000 uh, uh, tons and uh, 265 uh, tons. The current biomass is about the reference points proposed by GFCM. The fishing mortality decreases constantly until 2007 and then increases again being higher for ages two and three. The stock can be considered as uh, sustainably exploited. The, the level of evidence in that time was considered intermediate, higher than proposed reference points by GFCM. Uh, Since this, this stock can display large fluctuations associated with analogous fluctuations in recruitment, and since the exploitation rate is equal to the precautionary threshold, the advice is not to increase fishing mortality. Moreover, numerous studies have shown that the dy dynamics, of dynamic population, dynamic of anchovy and sardine populations are strongly, strongly influenced by success in the recruitment that it is, on the other hand, strongly influenced by the environmental conditions. It has been argued for a long time whether there are two separate stocks of anchovies in the Adriatic, one in the shallow waters, less than 50 meters of depth, on the northern West Adriatic, Western Adriatic, and the other in deeper offshore waters of the central southern part with extensive migrations. Uh, the, the biological uh, uh, basis for these stock differentiations uh, are still to be clarified, but it is evident that the spatial distribution of shared stock of anchovy is not limited to GSC 17 area only, but it is extended in GSC 18 area also. Therefore, future assessments will try to take into account combined data from these two GCAs. It should be noted that Adriatic small pelagic fishery is multi-species and effort on sardine stock cannot be separated from effort on stock of anchovy. Now a few words uh, about the uh, sardina pirhardus in GSCA 17. The Croatian catches of sardine uh, uh, represent the great part of the total catches of the Adriatic Sea. Exploitation is based on all the age classes from zero to six plus. Uh, the current assessments show that the trend in biomass of sardine started a slow but continuous increase since 2000. The 2011 biomass estimations showed a rather high values. The current uh, uh, biomass is about the reference points and proposed by the GFCM. The fishing mortality starts to increase 2007 for the all ages. Available genetic data indicates 
that uh, sardine in GSC 17 constitute a single stock. The situation in GSC 18 is less clear. Stock assessment of sardine has been done until recently, considering stocks in GSC 17 and GSC 18 separately. However, in 2012, the working group on stock assessment of small uh, pelagics recognized that special distribution of shared stock of sardine is not limited to GSC 17 area only, but it is extended also into area GSC 18. Uh, the working group also noted that the important nursery area uh, of sardine is located in Gulf of Montpredonia, GSC 18, where sardine is exploited by the fry, by the fry fishery. Uh, biomass uh, of the stocks in GSC 70 decreased continuously from 80s to 2000. In the most recent year, a moderate recovery of the stock has been observed, accompanied by parallel increases in the recruitment and catches. Uh, the present status of the stock, we are still talking about the uh, sardina, up to 2011 can be described with high fishing mortality and intermediate evidence. Current biomass is higher than uh, references, reference points proposed by GFCM. Biomass level as well as recruitment level of showed a steep, steep increase in 2011. Because of that, there are no sign that stock of sardine and the Adriatic is suffering for high fishing mortality. Nevertheless, since this stock can display, display large fluctuations associated with uh, analogous fluctuations in recruitment, G GFCM advice is not to increase the fishing effort. Besides, since numerous studies have shown that the dynamics of anchovy and sardine populations are strongly influenced by the success in the recruitment, which is, on the other hand, strongly influenced by the environmental conditions, like for anchovy. Also, the special distribution of shared stocks uh, of sardine is not limited to GSC 17 area only, but it is extended in GSC 18 area also. Uh, so, so, practically, uh, 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 and it is proposed that future assessments uh, 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 needs to take into account combined data from both, both the GCAs. Moreover, an important, an important nursery area of this stock is located also in uh, Manfredonia, GSC 18, where the sardine stocks used to be exploited by, by the, free, by the uh, fry fishery. Okay. I am now, uh, let's say, a little bit uh, trying to to faster because it is about 15 minutes to 12. Okay, uh, the Mercer resources. Mm. Assessment of the Mercer has been carried out on most species of uh, fishes using mainly trawl surveys and confirming that in late, late 80s the Mercer resources were overfished. Uh, the Adriatic demersal catches are composed mainly of individuals of the age classes 0, 1, or 2. Therefore, trends in evidence reflect more a fluctuation in recruitment than a response to the fishery fishing effort. Also, the landing of subspecies, for example, European hake, has been sustained for a relatively long period in spite of heavy apparently unsustainable exploitation. This could be due to the adult occurrence in deeper waters outside the traditional troll fishing grounds, as it, as it occur occurs in the canyons of the Gulf of Lyon, for example, GSC-7. Hake is, what I already said, is the most important species in geographical, so by 18, representing about 20% of landings from trawlers. The normal landing of the European hake for the whole Adriatic Sea has been increasing since 1984, reaching the a maximum of about 7,000 tons in 1994. 
Since then, this growing lending trend has reversed, sharply declining. In 2011, the landings of Hague were about 3.792 tons in the west side, with the higher production from trawlers, followed by longliners. Along the east side, the production from trawlers in 2011 was about 439 tons, divided by 37 tons from Montenegro and 402 tons from Albania. Uh, the hake is one of the most studied the Melzer species uh, uh, in the Adriatic uh, Sea, partly due to its substantial impact in the basin. The current assessment results show a sharp increase of recruitment in 2005 and thereafter a level similar or higher than in the past years. In 2008, a new third lower peak was observed. No trends were detected. Total fishing mortality showed a decreasing trend 2000 to 2004, and then an increase in 2005 and 2006. Catches and mortality are dominated by troll fishing system. The stock is in overfishing and thus GFCM recommends considering a considerable reduction of the fishing mortality. Given these results, it is necessary to consider that a remarkable reduction of the fishing mortality is necessary. As observed in 2011, the fishing mortality from the Italian bottom troll trawlers represents about 80% of the total fishing mortality uh, in the GSC 18, and that of the Italian long lines is accounting for about 9.5% with an overall percentage of about 90%. While Montenegrin trawlers account only for about 1% of the uh, exerted on Hague in the GSCA and Albanian trawlers at about 9.7. Uh, moreover, the production of Hague in GSC 18 is split in 12.5% code by Italian long lines, 77.2 by Italian trawlers, about 1% by Montenegrin trawlers and about 9.4 by Albanian trawlers. Now we come to the SOLEA. Uh, rapid trawl landings for SOLEA were traditionally dominated by small sized specimens. They are basically composed by zero plus one and two year old individuals. Set net fishery lands mostly the same portion of the population with the while the otter troll fishery exploiting wider fishing grounds shows a different size distribution of the landings. In the eastern part of the basin, common soil is exploited mainly by set netters using tremor net. The catch composition is dominated by adults. Current assessment results show that the common soil in GSC 17 is a sub subjected to overfishing, being the current uh, uh, 2011 higher than the GFC references, reference points. Uh, what was proposed uh, uh, or what was recommended? A reduction of fishing pressures, uh, also taking into account that exploitation is mainly orientated towards juveniles and the success of recruitment seems to be strictly related to environmental conditions. GFCM suggests that this could be achieved by a two months closure for rapid trolling inside 11 kilometers or it's six nautical miles offshore along the Italian coast after the fishing ban. However, it is not sure that the adoption of longer, larger mesh size would correspond to a decrease of juvenile catches. Bulus Barbatus. Uh, in GSC 17, the signals coming from the Medit surveys are positive, suggesting a sti stable biomass and a really high recruitment estimated for 2012. However, the current stock assessment show that the estimated fishing mortality for red mullet in 2011 reaches very high value for the Italian fleet, in particular for specimens between 15 and 17 centimeter. 
while the fishing mortality estimated for the Croatian fleet increases for much bigger individuals, all are from, uh, from 17 uh, centimeters, but still remaining at lower values. The spawning uh, stock biomass follow a slight decreasing trend starting in 2008 from 900 tons in 2630, uh, three, uh, 6,300 tons in 2011. Similar considerations can be applied to the trend in total, bus, total biomass, which decreased by 50% from 2008 to 2011. The current analysis evidenced the different fishing patterns of, two, of the two fleets exploiting the species, which also determined by the behavior of the species. The Italian fleet is clearly, clearly targeting recruitment. Besides, the current fishing mortality for the Croatian fleet is low, while mortality for the Italian fleet is about both reference, reference points showing a possible situation of growth over fishing. GFCM suggests that it could be wise to reduce the fishing mortality on the recruitment, and this could be obtained by uh, a prolongation of the close season for trolling along the western Adriatic coast, where in autumn age zero recruits born in summer and, and, and where is the concentrated. Uh, Parapeneus longirostris in GSC 18. Um, Medits troll surveys data showed that the abundance of this shrimp was steadily growing from 1919. 99 to 2005, then a decreasing was observed in 2006, 2007, followed by a new increase in 2008 and 2009. While in 2010 and 2011, the evidence is decreasing again. Current assessment results by VPA, virtual population analysis, show that the highest fishing mortalities are applied on the age groups one and two. The yield per decruit analysis indicates a current level fishing mortality highest than the targeted reference point. The main uh, part, 71% of the total uh, 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 mortality in the GSCA 18 is exerted by the Italian fleet, while Montenegrin trawlers account only for about, only for about 1.7%. And uh, uh, mortality accepted on the GSCA and Albanian trawlers of about 27.1%. The stock is considered in overfishing and a reduction of the fishing mortality will be necessary. This could be achieved with the multi-annual plan based on a reduction of fishing mortality through fishing activity limitations and possibly fishing uh, uh, capacity decreasing. Squilla mantis in GSC 17, uh, current assessment results show that the stock is subjected to overfishing. Uh, the main and the mantis shrimp in GSC 17 exploited unsustainably, being the current fishing mortality in 2011 estimates with higher than GFC M reference point. Moreover, decreasing trends have been observed for recruitment and spawning stock biomass in the VPA results, and for the relative evidence and biomass in medits troll surveys. A reduction of fishing pressure is recommended. The relevant fleet effort or catches should be reduced until fishing mortality is below or at the, or at the proposed reference level in order to avoid future loss in stock productivity and landings. This should be achieved by means of multi-annual management plan, taking into account mixed fishery, fisheries considerations. Few words about the Elasmobranch fisheries in the, in the Adriatic Sea. Um, there are several checklists of the Elasmobranchs in the Adriatic. Most of these lists are reporting more than 50 species, depending on 
uh, which species status is con considered as valid or doubtful. Most recent checklists of the Elas Mobranks in the Adriatic Sea is reporting total of uh, 53 species within 28 sharks, one chimera and 24 batoid species have been reported as the permanent residents or occasionally visiting species. Uh, most of the elasmobranchs are not target species in the Adriatic Sea, but they are caught mainly as bycatch of bottom trolls, gillnets, and long lines, as well as by pelagic long lines and other fishing gears used in tuna, small pelagic fish, and sword fisheries. Smaller erasmobranchs, especially small sharks, rays, and skates, are also often and commercially important species of trolls. In certain areas, during some seasons, dogfish and hound sharks are targeted with gill nets, hence a part of commercial fishery during the recent decade, sports and recreational fishermen have started to target large sharks in big game fishing. So practically uh, this type of uh, fishing, including big game, it has now uh, also has a part um, uh, as a target species, for example, treasure shark, blue shark, and poor beagle uh, in big game fishing are the targets also uh, uh, in, uh, from the Elasmo branch. In, we could include it in Elasmo branch fisheries. Um, if we analyze the FAO statistics on the total landing of, uh, uh, of uh, Elasmo branch fisheries, reported as uh, in FAO statistics, sharks, rays, and chimeras group in the Adriatic division within the period 1970-2010, a 40-year long period, a maximum of landing has been reached in 1982 with about 2,649 tons, while minimum landings of just 292 tons were reported in 2002. If we compared um, uh, expedition, one of the most important expeditions uh, in the Adriatic Sea, which were connected with the, uh, uh, the Mersal resources. Practically, uh, there is a sentence here in the Institute that was, uh, that was expedition uh, which uh, targeted the uh, virgin populations in 1984 because the year uh, uh, suggests that it was uh, almost immediately after the Second World War uh, 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 and practically represents the virgin uh, uh, situation of stocks in the Adriatic, uh, according to the Mercer resources. And the another one uh, on which base uh, 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 this report, which I mentioned, uh, a recent state of uh, the Mersa resources in the Adriatic Sea uh, and uh, called in Medits in 1998 and uh, 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 bottom draw surveys showed that the main change in composition and distribution uh, of the Mersa fish resources was the, the decrease of Elas Nobranch diversity and frequency. Uh, uh, which parts of Elas Nobranch show those uh, great, great change in biomass are the skates and rays. So practically those two groups show the greatest change in biomass percentage. Furthermore, there was a change in community structure, a reduction of long-lived and slowly growing species. Uh, uh, for example, small-sized species such as, uh, such as uh, 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 Small, small spotted cat shark, Stilorhynchus canicula, and the brown ray, Raya miraletus, were frequently collected in both surveys, while some larger sharks and ray species disappeared or were rarely found during medit surveys in 1998. Uh, sorry. Uh, 
species specific data are, uh, are revealing that the, for certain species, a situation is even much worse. For example, uh, 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 data for Thornbuck Ray, uh, uh, Raya Clavata shows that from uh, 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 species with high evidence and widespread distributions throughout the whole uh, 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 area, for the whole Adriatic, Thornbuck Ray, Raya Clavata was now restricted to small limited area with low, low evidence. If we try to analyze uh, uh, troll surveys carried out in the area over the last six decades, the structurally depleted Elasmobranchs community was detected. The high Elasmobranch evidence and diversity characterizing the central Adriatic during the Huar survey in 1984-1949 disappeared. Practically, species richness and evidence were higher in the eastern coastal areas than elsewhere. Elasmobrach evidence in Croatian territorial waters was almost one order of magnitude higher than in Italy, where sharks and rays were largely absent except for a relatively high density zone in the upper part of the Adriatic, about the 50 meters is about, mainly composed of spur dogs, smooth house, and eagle rays. Overall, sharks declined stronger than rays, and more shark than ray species recorded significant, recorded significant declines. Okay. Um, the few words about the ecology and the mineral resources. Uh, the Adriatic, the Adriatic receives considerable nutrients enrichment from a river runoff, which leads to high primary production. Uh, the Northern and Central Adriatic does affect uh, uh, all, all uh, links in food chains and allows high production of fish. As a matter of, of fact, the Adriatic Sea represents one of the most productive Mediterranean areas for fishery purpose. In summer, during summer, when metamarine conditions are suitable, for example, high temperatures, extended period of calm sea, fresh water inflow, inflow uh, stratification, suitable stratification, which separates warmer surface water of low salinity from deeper and colder, more saline water may occur producing ideal condition for exceptional algal blooms and extended hypoxia and anoxia. Damages to the Mercer resources as well as to the sedentary and benthic uh, resources may be considerable. The Mercer species distributions seems to be linked more to biocenosis than depth, although biocenosis are considerably affected by both depth and sediment type. There is a great uh, variability of distribution of species, most of them being generally distributed in small areas, although seasonal migrations. Many of the species complete their biological cycle throughout, throughout of the whole basin with the reproduction area localized along the Italian side, for example, to Gurnard common cattlefish or Croatian coast, for example, solar. solar. The cruids of many species aggregate, aggregate along Western coast in summer and when they grow up, after two or three months, migrate towards the open sea because of the less extreme conditions in this area during autumn and early, early winter. Uh, on the other hand, there are several documented changes in the structure of the Mersal community in the Adriatic during last decades. There was a decrease of biomass 
with time, mainly observed in commercial demersal species as a result of increasing fishing impact until 2002. Moreover, from the comparison of the two troll survey carried out in 1948 and in 1998, a decrease of Elas Mobranch's importance, diversity, and occurrence was observed. Some bony fish replaced Elas Mobranch at the top of the catches. However, some differences were found in the relative occurrence and abundance by Elas Mobranch species. Small sized species such as Cyriorinchus canicula, small spotted cat shark, and the brown array, Raya miraletus, were frequently collected, while other species, bigger shark species, for example, and other rays, disappeared or were rarely found. Life history parameters of the species could explain the different reaction of Elasmobranch to, to fishery. Okay. You can see here uh, the length frequency uh, uh, distribution uh, during the uh, Huar expedition and the Medits. Uh, uh, for John Dory, it is Zeus, uh, uh, Zeus Faber, for example. And uh, 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 during the Huar expedition, the link frequency distribution was considerably different from that of the Merits. In uh, during Huar expedition, 72.5% of the capture had a total body length of over 30 centimeters. In in 1996, 1998, these larger sizes were found only in 15.5% of the individuals and juveniles were from three to 17 centimeters were dominant in the catches. The average uh, uh, value of the total body length for the entire sample was 32.65, sorry, centimeters during the Huar expeditions and only 18.71 centimeters for the merits. These negative changes were observed in both sexes. And in 40, 19, during the Huar expedition, the average body length of males was 33.93 and 36.80 for females. Whereas during the 1996 and 1998 surveys, the average length was only 20.33 centimeter and 20, uh, for males and 25.24 centimeters in females. So you can see here the drastic, drastic decrease in length frequency distribution, in uh, 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 special distribution and, and, and the biomass index at each station. You can see here during the Huar expedition, uh, special distribution with points, and you see now so much reduced, so much reduced special distribution and length frequency distributions with the with the uh, uh, specimens where it, the average length was so so small. Also, that was observed, uh, what I said, uh, 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 negative changes also uh, observed for Raya Clavata population during the 60 year period, including a reduction in the distribution area of the species, especially in the open, <coughs> especially in the open Adriatic Sea, where the torn back ray is now only sporadically fished, and including also uh, mean evidence index of the species, uh, what, which shows a significant decline and thus drastic decrease in, in, in Raya Kavata portion of the total catches. Also, it was observed now huge changes in the demographic composition of the population with an increase of the mean length of fish specimens and decrease in total 
length at first sexual, sexual maturity of females. You can see here on this picture, according to special, uh, special distribution of Raya Kravata during the, the, the Huar, practically virgin stock, uh, uh, expedition in 1948 and uh, 1949, uh, and medics during this period of 1996, 2000, uh, 2006. You can see completely a re re reduction of the special distribution of, for example, of Raya Clavata. Okay, I somehow I, I, I reduced some things, uh, and now I would like to say a few words about the, uh, um, let's say history, some kind of history of investigation of uh, 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 the Mercer resources in the Adriatic, because I think I'm in in general I'm obsessed with the history, you know. So it is sometimes very good. Uh, to know what kind of uh, type of expeditions and, and, and type of investigations were already done in the Adriatic, uh, especially on, on the Mersoli resources. So I would like to say a few words uh, uh, about uh, 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 such type of uh, investigation. So uh, numerous uh, uh, researchers uh, uh, on the Mercer resources have been uh, 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 carried out in the Adriatic Sea from the beginning of the last century up to today. Uh, many, many investigations have been uh, performed by means of the uh, 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 scientific cooperation of the marine research uh, uh, institutes that, that work in the, in, at the, uh, in the Adriatic Sea. We could say that the, uh, that the first uh, fishery uh, uh, biological survey, which covered the largest uh, uh, area of the Adriatic, uh, was the expedition Hua uh, in the period from 1948 and uh, 1949. Uh, 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 a fishery biological expedition uh, organized by the Institute of Oceanography uh, 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 and fishery in split. Uh, the purpose of the study performed with the uh, bottom trawl net was to determine uh, uh, the qualitative and quantitative uh, characteristic of the Mercer communities of fish, crustaceans, and cephalopods. Uh, the research uh, was conducted at the, on the accessible continental shelf in the territorial waters uh, of the former uh, Yugoslavia and Albania and the international waters of uh, uh, approximately 20 nautical miles of the Italian coast. Practically, it has, uh, it was uh, uh, 176 stations, uh, mostly in the open part of the Adriatic. And uh, that was some kind of, um, uh, investigation, what I already say, uh, a virgin state of, of the Mercer resources. Why virgin? Yeah, because it was uh, uh, years immediately uh, of, of, of this expedition was years in immediately after, uh, after the Second uh, uh, World War. Uh, after, <coughs> pardon, uh, uh, after the Huar expedition, uh, uh, several spatial and temporally limited studies of the Mercer's, uh, the Mercer resources were organized in different parts of the, of the Adriatic Sea. In, um, in uh, 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 1972, in the central Adriatic, uh, the laboratory of uh, Marine Biology and Fisheries of Fano and the Institute of Oceanography uh, uh, in Split uh, and Fisheries in Split organized joint research. Samples were uh, collected uh, 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 by means of bottom troll and net to analyze the demersal assemblages in terms of 
quantity and uh, 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 quality. Uh, uh, Pipetta expedition was the, the name of this uh, of this uh, 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 investigations or let's say expedition was first one. It was in in, in uh, 1972, and uh, in 1982, uh, the laboratory in cooperation again with the from Fano and uh, again the Institute of the Fisheries in Split started the. Most extensive research of the Merza communities in the Adriatic, and the name was uh, Pipetta Expedition, named after the fishing vessel which were used in the surveys. The entire surface of the north and central Adriatic to the Monte Gargano Cape were surveyed. The stations were systematically arranged in nine profiles, and samples were taken with the typical commercial bottom troll net known as Tartana. The research carried on as Grand Grund program, a common Italian national program, which established uh, 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 the monitoring of the Merzel communities on the basis of the uniform methodology of sampling and analysis of data for all the Italian seas. In this context, the, in the Adriatic, the arrangement of stations was changed to a bottom depth stratified a random shame. The Grund program ended in 2007. And uh, since 2001, uh, 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 research on the Merzel, sorry, uh, 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 research on the Merzel communities along the eastern coast of the Adriatic has been organized as the part of the uh, FAO uh, regional project Adria Med. Sampling, data collection, and processing was the same as in the Grund program. Uh, these surveys, uh, as the Grund, Grund surveys, were performed once a year uh, uh, during the autumn uh, and winter, winter period. Uh, the most investigated area was uh, 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 the Pomo, uh, Yavukapit, the northern Adriatic, and the channel area in the in the eastern Adriatic. Uh, there was around 100, uh, 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 180 stations in GCA in GCA 17, uh, and uh, there was joint uh, databases for the uh, uh, area GC. GC817. Uh, uh, the European uh, EU, the European uh, uh, con uh, community, has founded the uh, uh, new demersal surveys in the Adriatic since uh, in the framework of the MEDITS program, which covers all the trollable areas on shelves and the slope using the same standardized protocol and is carried out. Uh, once a year in spring summer period. Uh, in recent time, uh, new lines of investigations also are carried uh, uh, using a different uh, um, uh, type uh, type uh, or, or type of methodology, uh, including, for example, uh, for example, uh, uh, Solomon project. Uh, then uh, another one is uh, deep sea surveys. Uh, then, um, uh, then uh, underwater TV surveys and genetic uh, investigations, uh, and then uh, experimental investigations of deep, deep uh, Adriatic. Uh, the, for example, the, inside the Adriamed investigations, the start was in uh, the beginning of 2008, and uh, uh, that was connected with the experimental. Uh, uh, investigations of the deep, uh, deep uh, Adriatic in the southern part, what we already said. And during such type of investigations, it was uh, 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 possible to collect uh, uh, to collect uh, some uh, strange or example, let's say uh, uh, not so evident type of, of, of uh, uh, fish species and uh, other organisms which lived in. Uh, 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 such deep areas, uh, 
um, um, uh, what which is what is characteristics for the southern part. You can see here, for example, Hauliodus Haulio, loani. It was uh, very rare uh, in general in very rare species, but it lives in the southern part of the Adriatic. And then we uh, in, in practically uh, it, it was some kind of uh, some kind of uh, El Dorado. Uh, for new marine uh, species, which were for the first time, some of them uh, were for the first time uh, uh, so uh, uh, practically established uh, that it is the member of the uh, that it was they were a member of the of the fauna of the Adriatic Sea because it lives on the inaccessible uh, part of the Adriatic in the deep uh, areas, and after using some type of of of, uh, of uh, trolls. Uh, 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 which were uh, in possibility to catch uh, such organisms on such deep deep areas, uh, we found it some uh, uh, very rare and for the and for the first time, for example, uh, a type of uh, marine organisms which lived in such such habitats. Okay, it was uh, another uh, part, some kind of. Uh, 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 investigations uh, uh, underwater TV surveys of the of the Yabuka uh, of the Yabuka pit. Uh, uh, the 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 main goal of this kind of investigations were to 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 assess to to say what is the biomass, how much is the evidence uh, of the of the Nephrops uh, norvegicus, and for the first time you see here they use. Uh, um, they use underwater TV camera and uh, uh, surveys, and with also together with the genetic investigations. Uh, and then, uh, 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 for the first time, uh, 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 with the new new uh, uh, type of uh, of, of uh, research vessel, uh, completely built it uh, for the first time for the Institute for Oceanography. Of, of renovation fisheries uh, with the old name uh, BIOS. Uh, they made it some acoustic surveys uh, during the program uh, medias. And uh, it is very, very, uh, uh, it was uh, the, the, the purpose was to, to get the special uh, distribution and, uh, and the status of the, uh, uh, of the targeted species of small, small uh, pelagic. You here have a, let's some some kind of a visual uh, uh, visualization of the scientific research uh, in the Adriatic uh, uh, Sea. One of the new ones, uh, what could I say? For example, is DCF uh, data uh, collection um, framework, uh, which is con conducted by the Institute of Oceanography and uh, fisheries. It started in 2013. Um, this is uh, connected with the monitoring of commercial uh, fisheries. So practically that is some kind of, uh, let's say, monitoring of the, of the uh, uh, commercial fisheries, including uh, 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 monitoring of catches of commercial fisheries, including the Mersel, coastal uh, and pelagics and including also tuna as a, as a special part of, uh, of, of uh, commercial fisheries. And uh, there are some kind of, uh, most of them are scientific uh, surveys, including uh, these medits and, and, uh, and, and uh, medias. Okay. Uh, just to say, uh, uh, a few words about the medits, uh, uh, because uh, most of the results uh, 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 for the demersal resources uh, obtained during uh, 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 this type of um, survey, uh, a Mediterranean International Troll Survey Program, um, is practically an international bottom troll survey designed to uh, produce basic information. Uh, 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 on the Mersal resources in the Mediterranean. In terms of population distribution and demographic structure on the continental shelves and along the upper slopes from 10 to 
800 meter depth. Uh, um, the program uh, began in 1994 with only four partners, uh, Spain, France, Italy, and I think Greece. Afterwards, in 1996, the program was enlarged to other Mediterranean uh, 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 countries, uh, such as Slovenia, Croatia, Malta, Cyprus, uh, Albania, Morocco, Montenegro, etc. And uh, at, uh, at present, uh, present moment, uh, 11 countries are involved in, in, the, in, the, in the project. Uh, Practically, uh, there again is the laboratory of uh, marine biology and fishery in Fano Institute in Split and Fishery Research Institute uh, in, in Slovenia are involved in, in, uh, in uh, uh, this type of uh, uh, project. Uh, uh, in the Adriatic Sea, uh, uh, the study area covers the whole GSEA uh, 17 northern and central Adriatic since what I already said, 1996. Uh, uh, what is the uh, uh, one, uh, one uh, survey is, is uh, uh, carried, was carried out uh, each year, applying common standardized sampling uh, uh, protocols, uh, which included the design of the survey uh, type of sampling gear, the information, which what kind of uh, information it could be, it should be proposed to collect, the management of data, and the production of uh, common standardized analysis of 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 data. And uh, for this type, uh, uh, I think that was 270 stations uh, in the Adriatic and. Uh, uh, the sampling was uh, 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 was um, by by specially designed scientific uh, uh, bottom troll net. I think that the name is uh, GOC seventy three. Okay, this is not so important, but it is important to know that uh, uh, during this type of uh, this type of uh, uh, project or let's say uh, uh, pro uh, investigation. Uh, most of the data were collected for for the the Marzal, uh, the Marzal resources. Okay, now mm, what we should say more about this? Uh, this is the 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 uh, uh, percentage uh, you can see here on this three three uh, diagrams in evidence uh, um, biomass and number of species in uh, the total catches for the uh, main uh, faunal categories which were collected during the the uh, medits uh, so practically if you can see here uh, uh, according to evidence uh, uh, 90 percent this yellow part of the custard pie uh, um, uh, is uh, uh, depends on uh, bony fish, 90%, uh, according to total evidence they included. Uh, bony fish is also for the total biomass, 74%. Uh, and the uh, uh, number of species, it's about, uh, about uh, bony fish is uh, 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 62, 62 uh, uh, percent included that the total number of uh, species which were which were collected was 200 and uh, 280 i i think it is not uh, necessary to remember uh, but in general uh, in evidence in biomass and the number of species dominated the uh, uh, bony fish or stachyus okay okay in this uh, huge monograph, uh, 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 there is a, a part uh, uh, which you can use this and try to see in much more details uh, 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 the trend uh, uh, over the whole period of the 
total evidence, biomass, and number of species uh, caught in the medit service for the main fauna uh, categories, bony fish, elasmobranch, cephalopods, and crustaceans, and for the total catch as well. You can see here for each uh, of, the, of these categories, uh, the status and trend of the of the each part, for example, total biomass index, total evidence index, total number of species, uh, uh, biomass index, uh, evidence index uh, 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 for each type of fauna category. I, I am not trying to 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 in, uh, speak uh, for each part. You can see if you get this type of. I think that it is possible in fauna to get. Uh, this uh, book, uh, Recent State of the Mercer Resources. So practically you can use the library in FANO and uh, take this, uh, 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 this book. Uh, I should just try to point uh, the main, uh, the main uh, uh, results in general uh, for some kind of some some of the of the catches some of the species for example uh, if you see this this uh, list uh, which is presented in the book uh, a list of the species ranked by mean occurrence from 1996 until 2020 uh, uh, for example 10 species uh, uh, has uh, occurrence higher than 50 percent of, of the station so practically, you can see uh, the that list. For example, uh, Merluzius, Merluzius, Aloteotis media. You see here Trachorus, Trachorus, Serranus, Cepola, uh, Trisopterus minutus, Trisopterus minutus. Sorry, Ilex condidetti and Graulis mollus barbatus. And you will see that the ten species uh, uh, has uh, uh, occurrence higher than uh, fifty percent of, on the station. List another list is um, of the species was the uh, was ranked by a, a mean biomass index also for the period from 1996 to 2012 uh, 20 sorry and the highest value are reported uh, for the uh, two small pelagic species uh, Engraulis and Crassicholus uh, uh, and Spratus Spratus uh, 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 practically. Uh, index of uh, uh, biomass was the highest for the Engraulus and Crassicholus, and the third place has uh, Spratus Spratus. And the second place is Melutius, followed by Mullus Barbatus, uh, Squalus Acantians, and Lepidopus Caudatus. Totally, uh, 26 species are represented with uh, a biomass index lower than uh, 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 one kilo per. Uh, uh, per uh, uh, square kilometer square. Uh, then um, also you have another list uh, of species ranked by mean evidence index for the same period, and um, uh, the highest evidence indices have been recorded for again for the uh, uh, pelagic uh, small pelagic species and Graulis and Crassicholus and the Spratus Spratus, and another another species. Another most evident species are Trachorus trachorus, Serranus hepatus, Merluzius merluzius, Sardina pirchardus, Mullus barbatus, Trisopterus minutus, and Aloteotis media. And uh, I will show you uh, uh, an example what you can find uh, uh, in, 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 in uh, 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 results, practically. Those are the results. For each species uh, which which uh, which are, are included in this in this uh, 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 book, so practically I will show you um, example, and uh, so practically it is divided in the re, uh, in the parts. For example, cephalopoda, then you have uh, 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 fishes, and and then uh, crabs, for example, and and. Uh, uh, it is all divided and, and, and the results are, are looking like this. I will show you for, for some species, just to introduce you. If you want to, de in detail, if, 
your maybe subject will be in the future the other resources so why not to see in in this kind of uh, a book uh, some kind of monography practically you can see how the results are presented for for each uh, species uh, according to according to the uh, um, types of presentation for this medits uh, uh, medits uh, pro uh, project or medits uh, uh, expedition uh, so it is presented by the the the, the photo uh, and of, of of species this is uh, uh, in in uh, uh, sepia elegance and uh, the name of the in english italian and uh, and uh, slovenian and in this is uh, uh, the title is uh, in croatian so practically you have uh, here example for the sepia elegance it is elegant cuttlefish sepia elegante in slovenian mala sipa in the in croatian sipica rumeca so you have data uh, uh, about the uh, 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 maximum uh, uh, distribution you see here for example this red this red uh, color showing uh, 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 a distribution of this species with the with the number of of uh, uh, specimens uh, practically evidence index uh, per each this is a part for example where it is the most evident see here and then you have a, a persistence area evidence index also of sepia and then um, uh, diagrams that where you can see uh, 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 data about the biomass index, uh, about the, the the evidence index, and for example, it is uh, uh, in this type of of, of uh, species is is uh, for example a uh, few words are written about each each species. For example, it is found within 100 meter of depth, although greatest. Uh, evidence were steadily found on sandy bottoms between 30 and 50 meters of depth in the north part of the Adriatic and the whole eastern channel area. Occurrence highlighted the decreasing trend in the first three years after two, 2000. The occurrence is stable around the mean value of 43.6%. Uh, although biomass and evidence index fluctuated widely over the period, Generally, a decreasing trend has been observed for both indices, touching the lowest value in 2010. And you have here the data about the median value of biomass indexes was 0.7 kilo per um, uh, kilometer square, and evidence index was 75 specimens per kilometer square. So practically, you have um, another very important species is sepia officinalis, again, the procedure is the same and a uh, uh, few words about the uh, biomass index uh, 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 the indices of evidence and biomass about the fluctuation length frequency distribution and another is elex coindetti etc etc i would not uh, uh, losing time uh, practically when you have this in this book so i just try to show you uh, uh, the procedure, uh, how is uh, written? Uh, you have here, for example, distribution area of juveniles for Roligo vulgaris. I think that it is connected also with the uh, the most important species, which were in the catches in in troll troll catches, and uh, according to the Marzola resources, which were most important for the Adriatic. And you have all the data, let's say very recent uh, data. Uh, 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 according to 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 the importance uh, so i i i really don't want to uh, squeeze students with this uh, <laughs> all this data so who wants to get more info i think that it will be he will be a, or she will be able to 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 see this uh, uh, in in this book uh, I will send uh, all uh, necessary uh, information for the students to, to to Stefano, and he will get all the data what, uh, about the most important uh, literature, which is important to uh, 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 for the students. 
uh, all necessary data. I will send the, the presentation. So who will need it um, and who will try to be much more inside you could ask uh, Stefano uh, for this 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 uh, presentation in general. But I said that it is mostly connected with this this book, uh, uh, which I will send uh, again uh, new info about this 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 book. So practically, I would like to, in general, to finish this 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 uh, presentation. I could only. Um, ask you if you are interested uh, uh, to show it um, uh, let's say let's say uh, more info uh, more info about this this uh, new data about the changes in in uh, ichthyofauna uh, which are connected with, with the processes i already said with meridionalization, tropicalization, with the Lesepsian migration. Uh, uh, I was the member of the of the team, uh, CSM, uh, Central, uh, this is, a, this is a, the center of this uh, 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 commission for the Mediterranean Sea, is in, the, is in um, Monaco and uh, President and uh, I think uh, the main uh, director of this institution is Frederic Brian. And uh, in general, uh, the boss is uh, Prince Albert, uh, who is the main uh, uh, main uh, chief. Even though Frederic Brian is the boss of the of the of the station in Monaco. And we, 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 we prepared a, a very interesting um, atlas uh, of, uh, of uh, new species for the, uh, this is the second edition uh, for, the, for, the, for the Mediterranean Sea, including all the changes uh, which happened, uh, uh, which happened with start from the, from the opening of the Suez Channel until today. So practically, if someone is interested in um, such type of, of uh, info or, or to see the book, I think that it is possible to find it in, in uh, Fano. I, I for sure know that who, who bought it, uh, because one of the authors, uh, as like as me, uh, was the Ernesto Azzurro, my great friend, which uh, was, I think, now working, I think, in Ancona. I'm not so sure. But previously he worked in Livorno, I think. Uh, and um, we prepare such nice atlas with the, with the with the, all the new data about the new new elements of the Mediterranean ichthyofauna. Okay, at this moment I will um, I will uh, finish. I hope that it. I know that in some sometimes it is boring um, to hear the. To hear uh, uh, all these uh, numerical data, I try to escape uh, all these graphs, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, and try to my voice to to present you, because sometimes uh, you uh, are able to much more concentrate on the pictures, and uh, you are losing the, the the voice. I think that the voice is uh, very important, and what you need to remember it, you need to remember it. The difference in troll catches between the southern and the uh, and the north central and the north northern part, you see. You must remember what are the main uh, target species in means of pelagic uh, uh, resources, in means of the mersal resources. What are the differences between uh, the types of uh, fishing gear from? Practically from uh, from Croatia and from Italy, yeah, the, these two countries are in general the, the, the dividing the, the resources of, of of Adriatic Sea. So if you have uh, any question, uh, whatever, uh, and remark, or you would like to know much more, 
uh, please uh, send it to my email address. I think that uh, uh, Stefano will give you to you. In general, I will be in contact with Stefano and I will send him all these uh, uh, presentations. And, and, and even though if you want to publish papers in the most respectable uh, journals, which are connected with the general Adriatic uh, uh, fauna. I, I, I will be glad to send to you if you are interested. And not just uh, Adriatic, we publish also a nice paper where we check all the rec uh, recorded history for the Mediterranean Sea. That was all from me. Thank you for your attention and thank you for your patience uh, to hear my boring voice. Okay, th thank you, Jakob. Uh... Thank you very much for uh, the broad view uh, on uh, fishery problem in the Med, in the Adriatic, uh, and uh, uh, I guess there may be some question, uh, but I would like uh, to start uh, with my question. I don't want to take uh, uh, over the students, but I have a few, uh, two questions. The first one is uh, about the large uh, osc oscillation in biomass that you show, for example, sardinas or anchovy. Yeah. Uh, uh, that there's, there's, a, there's a kind of order of magnitude among uh, the, the top and down, uh, up and down. So, uh, are these, uh, uh, what is your explanation? Are these natural uh, fluctuations or there's something else? That's the first question. The second one, uh, uh, my premise is that I'm not an expert in this field, of course, so you know already, everyone. Uh, the second one is, all the, are all these data uh, from uh, this survey, for example, the one that you show that are in this book that actually is available in this institute we have here, uh, are, are some, somehow uh, now also digitalized, I mean, uh, are uh, public, uh, people can uh, download this, the raw data I'm talking about and make uh, statistics and elaboration. Thank you. That, th those are the two questions. Okay. Uh, first, we, we, I will try to uh, answer it on the second, uh, because it is uh, in, uh, published by I'm not sure it is available, but I I I, I hope that it is available in uh, in farm, or even though in corner. This 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 type of, uh, this book was for sure uh, 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 published, and the author main author was Corrado Piccinetto. So practically, I I I am sure that that this uh, this this type of book. Was available at the uh, at the library of laboratory in in Fano and also in laboratory of Ancona for sure. I will send you. Uh, this is the monograph uh, monograph series number five, published in 2012, and it has 220 pages. So uh, this is this is this is I think available. If it is not, I will say to my uh, like like library uh, department to send it to you. Uh, uh, I think that there is I had I think one one hundred copies were available in the in the institute of this book, and I hope that uh, it, will, it will be available for the student. For sure, because the main author, the main author is Corrado Piccinetti. Yes, that is the reason. And another one is Chiara Manfredi, and two other ones are Nedo Vergoc, which was who was uh, the, the, the the director of the institute in Split, and Juan Marchetta is from the from the uh, 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 institute in the, the Slovenia and Yugia. So for sure, this will be available. If not, please you need to tell me and. I will send uh, copies, or uh, let's say hard copy, uh, for, for you uh, to, to be available to the students, and you, of course. And the first one was connected with the uh, huge fluctuations of, of, of a small pelagic. 
when I started, uh, uh, I will always go back to the history. Um, when I started to work, uh, I was in the department for Ichthyoplankton Service. Uh, my, my, my boss was the professor, uh, Sobona Regner, and uh, he tried to learn me and to, 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 to push me to see, uh, to, to, to think much more globally. And um, if you see in the past, there was a huge, uh, in general, it was a huge uh, 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 discrepancies uh, and uh, huge fluctuations of small planets, including Sardine and Nature. I'm much more connected with the Sardine because my, my master degree thesis, not doctoral, but my master, my master degree thesis was connected with the Sabino army. And uh, I also tried uh, to find uh, how all uh, uh, the larvae of Sardine and try to establish the, uh, the, uh, the old, uh, how much is old in days. And uh, I was uh, in that time a young one and I was on the field and tried to collect the larvae of uh, Sardine. And I, when I picked it with a special constructed type of gear, uh, nearby we lived in uh, Castella, uh, Castella Bay, and I started to collect, and I tried to, uh, to, to uh, uh, collect the larvae of the uh, of the sardine together with the, the otolith, which were too small, and I need to use uh, very special needles to extract such small uh, 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 um, autoids from the library. And uh, I tried uh, to collect and to see uh, how much old are the, uh, such larvae. Then when I get the data about the days, uh, how much is old, I practically get everything. And in the history, such fluctuations were observed uh, in uh, Dalmatia, we know that the part of Croatia, where the capital is split. Uh, my grandfather was also the fisherman, and he tried to collect uh, small pelagic again. And uh, there was a huge fluctuation uh, uh, that in some kind of period uh, in the 30s, 1930, uh, where, let's say, practically disappeared sardine. And that was the main catch of the people who lived near the, near the sea. The main, especially on the islands. And in that time, uh, uh, another species of cure, like some kind of replacement, was with the sardinella aurita. Built uh, sardine, you know. And uh, there was a huge uh, period of uh, hungriness because people were hungry. Why? Because they were not sardine. And uh, during that time, it was also a disease uh, uh, in my yard, peranospora. Do you, do you know what is peranospora? It was the, the kind of disease of, of, of uh, food. And then practically people, especially from the islands, were in period of... Uh, the Second World War is coming, and at that time, a lot of people went out from Dalmatia and trying to go find where is the where is the sardine again, and they started. They went to Lampedusa, where it was uh, at that time. It was the peak of the evidence of sardine, and they started to catch, catch, and it was a nice period. Then again. Uh, at the time of the of the uh, that time, the Lampedusa started uh, Sabina to decline after four or five years, and uh, Sabina became again in the in the patches. So come back, and that was uh, connected with the huge number uh, of parameters. I I started to learn uh, that uh, the eruptions, the eruptions on the sun. Could affect, could affect the biomass of small pelagics in all the oceans of the planet Earth. 
So practically, environmental factors, uh, all the energies, and because the small pelagics are exposed to huge fluctuations. I think my theory that it will never disappear means that you will never catch again. But fluctuations will happen with, uh, according to some periods, but now uh, Adriatic is like the Mediterranean Sea is exposed to huge impact of fishing gears. And uh, uh, according to environmental factors, which are changed according to, for example, what I say, the eruptions on the, on the sun. Everything is mixed and everything could impact the evidence of small pelagics. So no fear in general, let's say, uh, no fear for the small pelagics, but how much will be available is a biomass that will fluctuate. Okay. Did I explain the in well? I'm not so good in, let's say, for this type of uh, explanations. I'm not so good in English to explain it uh, much more precise. But in general, uh, it is much more huge problem with the, the marginal resources because you know, for example, uh, elasma branchs has some kind of uh, very low of uh, reproduction. For example, two or three. Uh, uh, live as a specimen will be available per, per, uh, per year, for example. And the impact of the huge trolls, especially from the our side, I know it very well, the huge impact of the, of the trawlers are uh, 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 enormous. And this is the problem. Practically, uh, enasma brands do not have time to recover the, uh, their population. That is, that is the most, and for me, the marine resources are a much more dangerous situation than pelagics. Mm -hmm. In very simple, in very simple words, okay? Thank you, Jaco. Other uh, input from the room? Uh, no? Input from? From the room, I'm asking the students. Uh, ah, you're asking students, okay, okay. Okay, so <clears throat> Yakov, thank you very much for uh, your presentation. Uh, you will send us uh, to me the PowerPoint uh, yes. when you can. PowerPoint, the info about the the info about the presentation. The... This file. The, okay, the... okay. I will yeah. send. It. That's no problem. I will send the pro uh, the file. Uh, also, presentation which is connected with the with the impact of new species in the Adriatic in general, because it is very important. For, for me, if one or two species established a population in the Adriatic, we could not speak about the more the problems which are now presented, which are now actual. For example, we could not uh, speak about the impact of, for example, I don't know, trawlers mm -hmm. and other resources, uh, on uh, pelagic resources, we could speak only about one thing, about the terrorist meals and their effect on the uh, uh, fauna in the Adriatic Sea. Do you know what I'm talking about? Because I know that now my friends and uh, researchers from uh, Turkey, from, from, from uh, Israel, from Lebanon, and Cyprus especially, and Greece, they are only speaking about now, nowadays, only about one species. <coughs> All other problems disappear. <coughs> How to kill this type of species? How to extract it from the marine ecosystem, from the, from the sea? But it will not be possible at all. What happened, happened. Grazie, Yakov. Uh, we keep in touch. Of course. And I understand you also some papers connected the the pro changes in the Adriatic if you found them, and I will send the, if it is possible uh, also papers which are connected with these problems which are uh, now present in the, the in the eastern Mediterranean. Thank you. And, and the presentation. Thank you. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Thanks to students which were very uh, polite and uh, how can I say uh, has the nerves to, to listen for for how much hours my my voice okay thank you very yes, much is is uh, the next generation okay, okay.
if they need any help, you will give them also, you will give them my, my email. Okay. Ciao. Bye-bye. Ciao. Ciao. My best regards to all. Ciao.